Assalamu alaikum my dear students I am fine and I am hopeful that you will be sailing in the same boat in today's virtual class I will try my best to make you aware about adjective to make you aware about adjective I am Mudassir Ahmed Qureshi teacher currently posted at Government Higher Secondary School Sanzipora Mawa District Kupwara Jammu and Kashmir what is adjective an adjective is a word that modifies a noun or noun phrase or describe its referent referent means what we are referring to it is its semantic role is to change information given by noun adjectives are the main part of speech of the english language although historically they were classed together with nouns what does adjective gives you uh, let me adjective gives you the quality of the noun he is a boy is a simple sentence i will tell you he is a boy it is a simple sentence but if we will tell you he is a good boy good means he, uh, good is giving quality to the boy boy is the noun good is adjective so let us start adjectives are also called describing words adjectives are placed before noun or pronoun for example we wore a black jacket this black describes the quality of the jacket jacket is black in color she is sitting in red car the car is red i have five friends this is the amount of friends i am having she has silky hairs her hairs are very silky this means that adjectives are placed before noun or pronoun see jacket is the noun and adjective is placed before it car is the noun red is the adjective it is placed before it so we may in nutshell we may say adjectives are also called describing words there are six types of adjectives there are six types of adjective of quality adjective of quantity adjective of number possessive adjective demonstrative adjective interrogative adjective <coughs> let us first go to adjective of quality adjective of quality refer to kind degree or quality kind of something sometimes they are also called descriptive adjectives they are called descriptive and what does adjective of quality gives you it gives you the <coughs> uh, uh, description uh, of some thing place person or a thing uh, for example the hungry cats are crying here it gives you the quality of the cat what does the quality of the cat is hungry the red rose the red rose the rose is red she is wearing a beautiful gown it gives the quality of a thing second is adjective of quantity adjective of quantity is always used in uncountable nouns it is used in uncountable because it gives you the estimated amount of the noun or pronoun estimated amount of the noun or pronoun uh, for example i will say give me some milk some some is the adjective of quantity milk is the noun quantity it gives you the amount it indicates uh, estimates amount uh, 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 what does adjective of quantity estimates it estimates uh, amount and it is used remember remember one thing it is used in uncountable nouns few liters of oil left in my tank not uh, if i will say that two liters of oil left in my in the tank then it is not ad, uh, adjective of quantity then it is not adjective of quantity few I have estimated that uh, it, the few is an estimate. Now, adjective of number. Adjective of number. It is used in countable nouns. It is used in adjective. Uh, uh, adjective of number is used in countable. Let us go to previous sli slide. If I will change the sentence, few liters of oil left in the tank. I will say two liters of oil left in the 
tank then what does this sentence converts to this sentence converts then into adjective of number because adjective of number is used in countable nouns whereas adjective of quantity is used in uncountable nouns used with the countable nouns it denotes the number of nouns or pronouns including their position or place in a certain order in the sentence for example they have three children three number particular number of children i saw nine policemen in a row nine policemen in a row nine you do the accurate number nine in a row and also policemen how they are sitting in a row she is 10 years old she gives the age possessive it gives you the position or ownership possessive determiners constitute a subclass of determiners it constitutes a subclass of which modify a noun by attributing a position to some or something uh, uh, there are eight possessive adjectives my mine you you are dear her his it's our it, these are called possessive adjectives this is my house i own this house this is my ye mera ghar hai our job is almost done humne apna kaam khatam kiya our humne our her bo books are interesting uski kitabe interesting Hey, this gives you the position or ownership possessive uh, uh, adjective another one is demonstrative adjective this particular adjective demonstrate a particular place person or a thing demonstrative adjective modify so that we know which specific person place or thing is mentioned that means it points to a particular place person or a thing this that these to those this that these to those are demonstrative adjectives this house is very beautiful give me that book those flowers are beautiful these are called demonstrative adjectives interrogative adjective interrogative adjective means a uh, interrogative note of interrogation what does that mean we uh, asking questions asking questions those words in a sentence which ask you question which ask you question are called interrogative ad uh, adjectives for example there are three interrogative adjectives what which whose whose ball is this which is your car what dress are you wearing who's which what these are called interrogative adjectives i hope that you will be you are now satisfied and you will be clearly feel that what the adjectives are and what are the types of adjectives remember me in your prayers but with the request kindly maintain social distancing so that we can defeat this corona virus and we will go to school uh, which we are missing very badly i may say because virtual classroom can't fulfill the needs which we uh, 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 because this is a one way traffic dear students i am sorry this is a one way traffic in the classroom you poses the questions but here you can't pose the questions um, we hope that this co coronavirus will vanish from this planet and we will happily be in our schools thank you very much god bless you